This video is to show you how to create goals that will migrate or pull into employee performance reviews. The first thing we need to do is we need to create a goal. So let's go to the hamburger, type in goal, we'll pull up goals, and we'll click add new. Here we need to put in our title and make sure it's active. A description is optional. And we always need to have a beginning date. This is 2021, so I'm going to start with January 1. I'm never going to fill in the end date, however. The category, if you have categories, is optional. But you definitely want to make sure that both the performance development and performance review buttons are checked uh, to add the goal to those areas. So let's click Save. And now that we've created the goal, we can add this goal to multiple employees uh, if we choose. So let's go in as if we're going to add that goal to multiple people. So this is going to be under performance development. So I'm just going to type in development or something close. And it pulls up our listing. I'm going to take off this filter real quick. I'm also going to just do data so we can see our list of employees. So when you want to create a goal or assign a goal to an employee that will pull into their performance review, our only option is to assign a company goal. We also have this assigned personal goal, but we don't want to use that because it will not pull into the performance review. So do assign company goal. You can choose to sign it to single one person. We can make it a shared goal where everybody shares an equal value, or we can share, uh, assign the same goal to multiple people. So if we say we want to assign it to multiple people, then we can select the looking glass and we can say we want to assign it to Jennifer and Josh. And when we apply, it gives us two employees and then we can look for our goal. We want to do a title, and again, we're only going to give it a start date, and if we had additional information we wanted to fill in, we could do that here. We'll save it. So now, if we look up, we've got that same goal has been assigned to two employees. So to see it flow into the performance review would be the steps to go in and create the performance review and you would see this under the company goals in the review.